EastEnders has teased Gray Atkins's downfall. The lawyer is still in the clear over the murders of his wife Chantel, Tina Carter and Kush Kazemi, but his erratic behavior has caught the attention of his boss Laura Awayinka. Gray was nearly arrested for his backseat romp with ex-girlfriend Chelsea Fox recently, leading to him being suspended from the firm pending an investigation. Monday's August 30th episode saw Gray's problems mounting because he no longer had money coming in due to his suspension from work. He attempted a charm offensive for Laura and the firm's HR representative when they arrived at his home to discuss his status. Gray was floored when Laura announced that he would be sacked from the firm because his run-in with the police wasn't a good look. The HR representative presented Gray with his termination notice, but before Laura left, she told Gray Shed figured out his true colors long ago. Laura also knew Gray was responsible for sending her abusive messages online. His former boss threatened him with police action and then also revealed he wouldn't be getting his final bonus check. If you even think of appealing, it'll make sure everyone knows what kind of man you are, Laura insisted. She then added insult to injury, I'm someone who sees you for exactly who you are. A man who thinks HES smarter than everybody else, especially a black woman. You've got this great front to yourself. Big house, nice car, expensive suit. With no job and no money, there's gonna be nothing for you to hide behind. Everybody will see you for the nasty little misogynist you really are. Threatened by women, especially women like me. Gray was absolutely enraged by the news, especially after he overheard Chelsea bragging earlier about the designer clothes Shed charged on the lawyer's credit card. Chelsea refused to back down over the charges when threatened by Gray, leaving him spiraling. In shocking scenes, Gray rocked up to the Vic where he told a lie to Shirley Carter that had recently seen Tina on a bus. I think she was trying to come home, he bluffed. Will this lie lead to Gray's ultimate demise?